Exploring the intricate relationship between caffeine and atrial fibrillation sheds light on the complexity surrounding this common heart rhythm disorder. With AFib affecting a significant portion of the global population, understanding how caffeine consumption influences the risk and management of this condition becomes paramount. AFib stands as one of the most prevalent heart arrhythmias worldwide, characterized by irregular and accelerated heartbeats. The condition poses serious health risks, including an increased susceptibility to stroke and heart failure. Symptoms such as a quivering heartbeat, fatigue, palpitations, difficulty breathing, dizziness, and an uneven pulse often accompany AFib. Patients with AFib are frequently instructed to avoid all caffeine, but what does the data show? Does all caffeine need to be avoided in patients with atrial fibrillation? Let's discuss caffeine's role in cardiovascular health. Caffeine, a widely consumed stimulant found in various beverages and food items, affects cardiovascular health in nuanced ways. The impact of caffeine on heart rhythm and overall well-being varies based on individual sensitivity and dosage. Common sources of caffeine include coffee, tea, chocolate bars, soft drinks, and energy drinks. While moderate caffeine intake is generally considered safe, excessive consumption can lead to elevated blood pressure and palpitations due to its stimulatory effects on the nervous system and cardiovascular system. Some studies have suggested that high caffeine intake may trigger cardiac arrhythmias, underscoring the importance of moderation. The correlation between coffee consumption and AFib risk has been a topic of extensive scientific inquiry, with findings presenting a mixed picture. Some studies suggest a potential protective effect of moderate coffee intake, indicating a nuanced relationship. On the contrary, other research fails to conclusively establish a significant association, emphasizing the complexity of this relationship. Recent investigations have indicated that consuming a moderate amount of coffee, typically ranging from one to three cups per day, may potentially lower the risk of AFib in certain individuals. However, caution is warranted, as high doses of caffeine derived from coffee or other sources could potentially exacerbate AFib symptoms, especially in individuals with pre-existing heart rhythm disorders. There are some individuals where even a small amount of caffeine or coffee can exacerbate AFib symptoms. Patients with significant sensitivity to caffeine may need to avoid all caffeinated products. Most individuals diagnosed with AFib are strongly advised to monitor and limit their daily caffeine consumption to 300 mg or less, per the American College of Cardiology. Keep in mind that most cups of coffee have about 100 mg of caffeine. Seeking personalized advice and guidance from healthcare professionals is crucial to effectively manage caffeine intake and its impact on AFib symptoms. This personalized approach can help individuals make informed decisions tailored to their specific health needs and conditions. Energy drinks, popular among individuals seeking instant energy boosts, contain a blend of caffeine, guarana, taurine, and other stimulants. The synergistic effect of these ingredients may increase the risk of AFib in susceptible individuals. Beyond caffeine, energy drinks may also contain added sugars or artificial sweeteners, further complicating their impact on heart rhythm. Individuals with a history of heart rhythm disorders or AFib should exercise caution when consuming energy drinks, consulting healthcare providers to assess the potential risks and benefits associated with their intake. In general, I feel that caffeine from coffee is a much safer option for patients with AFib than energy drinks due to added stimulants. Adhering to safe caffeine consumption limits is crucial for maintaining optimal heart health and minimizing the risk of cardiovascular complications. Individuals with AFib are recommended to limit their daily caffeine intake to 300 mg or less. Exploring alternatives such as decaffeinated coffee, herbal teas, and caffeine-free soft drinks provides a way to enjoy flavorful beverages without the potential risks associated with excessive caffeine consumption. There are also several other lifestyle factors that affect AFib symptoms. Alcohol consumption, stress levels, sleep quality, and caffeine intake play significant roles in managing AFib symptoms and risk. Alcohol, even in moderate quantities, can increase the likelihood of developing AFib, necessitating careful monitoring or abstinence for individuals with heart conditions. Chronic stress can exacerbate AFib symptoms. 
highlighting the importance of stress management techniques. Poor sleep quality and conditions like sleep apnea significantly contribute to AFib risk, emphasizing the need for proper sleep hygiene and treatment. Recent studies on caffeine and AFib have produced conflicting findings, underscoring the need for personalized advice from healthcare professionals. Crafting a caffeine strategy tailored to individual needs, medical history, and tolerance is essential for optimizing heart health and minimizing AFib episodes. By closely collaborating with doctors and monitoring caffeine intake, individuals can navigate the complexities of caffeine consumption in the context of AFib. In conclusion, understanding the intricate relationship between caffeine and AFib is crucial for individuals looking to maintain heart health and manage the risks associated with this prevalent heart rhythm disorder. By seeking personalized guidance, monitoring caffeine intake, and adopting healthy lifestyle practices, individuals can support a healthy heart rhythm and reduce the likelihood of AFib episodes.